Will you be at the Blue Ocean Festival Film Festival, uh, September 24th through the 30th here? With, uh, a bunch of big, uh, big names in the industry. The Blue Ocean Film Festival. Yes, and if you're not, will you please think about it? I'm fine yeah. about it right now. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, it sounds really cool. Can you tell us about it at all? Uh, <laughs> Uh, we do participate in the Blue Ocean Film Festival. It's super amazing and cool. It takes place right over at the Portola Hotel Monterey Conference Center. We also are a venue for film. Um, there's some of the world's greatest uh, filmmakers, photographers, and artists that talk about the ocean. So it is in the last week of September. Come back, especially if you're a member to next year. Um, and we're going to have an exhibit surrounding uh, that issue at the time. So that's <laughs> I know a lot of your art reflects a lot of pollution that are in our oceans here locally, but are you also aware of uh, the non-native plants that are invasive to our landscapes here in our yeah, I, <laughs> cool. <laughs> I became a non-native plant a hard young teenager when I was very to from Los Angeles to Woo! Big Sur. Um, I, I had a multi-vitamin bus. And my girlfriend and I at the time had found these long, fine-looking plants on the side of the road and on our antenna. Uh, right we're cruising down at the one, like, do -do -do, teenager, whatever. And this guy in the ranger truck waved us down and like, pulled us over. We're like, what do we do? We grabbed the thing and said, have you any idea what you're doing? Not really, tell me. But apparently, it was a uh, plant that someone you know, brought in and just took over all of and you were the size of the And we were seeding it all over the place. <laughs> so, from the 17 year old me, I'm sorry about that. But, so, yes, there's, the, there's all things like this that like young people, we don't think like, know until you know. And so, that was part of the interesting like, doing this as well. Is, you know, I was just as bad with like water bottles and plastic bags and stuff. They're terribly convenient. But then you find certain things out and it switches it and you can't go back. So that's what the hope of this. But more people should find out about non-native species around here because it's as well as very important. Kind of the idea around it is that, you know, and with it's been such a an interesting weird and wonderful to have um, so many people listen to our band, you know? And so with that comes like an awareness. It's like that we have people's ears now. So we'll make more music, that's awesome. Oh, you're still listening. What else should we say, you know? And so you eventually start to truly kind of uh, speak your truth, speak your mind and your heart. And so um, I really see it as almost like a responsibility to call to attention the things that I find important and it's interesting that lots of people find it important too. Hopefully, hopefully, one day. If you remember. I will. <laughs>